Alright guys, boys. We are getting one last chapter. I know it. It will be dropping December 20th. Dragon Ball Super Chapter 67, but we're not here for that. We're here about Chapter 66, which dropped eight hours ago. And, uh, my mans, we just found out a couple. I'm only going to go over a couple of things that we did not go over in our past couple of videos that we need to go ahead and add on. So, without further ado, let's get this started. So, starting off, we're back. We're back on the planet. Everybody's waking up. Blah, 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 blah. Freaking everyone's feeling weak because Moro is siphoning off their goddamn energy. Vegeta acts quickly. Get your tails off this ground. Get up. Get them off his head. Okay, look, listen. So, then we go over back to the battle. We got Goku. Goku's still fighting Moro. Beerus and we used to analyzing the situation. You know, the, the situation escalated to the point that Beerus truly thought to his heart of heart that it was time for him to step in because we all know Beers would have washed this. He would have ended this already. He would have been like, okay, done, all right? But nope, Grand Priest needs them. It's time to go back to the freaking the Grand Monastery, where we want to call it. This is a situation Earth has to handle himself. We leaves that information of hit that I said. Time for Goku to do this. Vegeta comes down there, freaking uses that for spirit vision. He's on the case. He is on it, bruh. Lo and behold, he can only siphon so much energy because his energy is being stripped as we speak. So Goku has to act fast. He's over here blitzing through every hand Moro can throw at him until Moro gets his little crummy little hands on him and starts sucking Goku dry. And like I said, they had to amass the energy. Piccolo give, so I was right. So we had to give Vegeta the idea that he had to amass some energy to give to Goku. And they give that what little energy they all had to Goku, which was very, 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 very little. They do that, he goes in the blue form. He couldn't obtain Ultra Instinct because it, was it wasn't enough God Key. The only one really giving God Key out of that bunch was uh, Dende and freaking Vegeta. So it definitely wasn't enough. The Key of Earth was not enough. So they have one last option because they're all if all else because since that failed, there was no hope. There was nothing Goku could do. But lo and behold, there was one last individual. One last person. Oob. Oob has divine key, has divine energy. Divine. That it was such an abrupt amount that it made absolutely no sense because it freaking it wowed everybody. Because Vegeta, Vegeta was in shock. He was like, "Where the heck did that come from? Hey, wherever it came from, it's okay. We're gonna use that to the best of our ability." He grabs that thing. I right, Kakarot, like I said, you better take this. You better give him some of that Ultra Instinct. You better end this now because this is your last chance. All right, Vegeta, I got you. Goku Susano. Go Susano, he's freaking over here, freaking playing a game of mercy with Planet Moro. Man, jumps straight out of the Goku forehead and says, Boy, I'm gonna give you this one last punch. This one last, and he, my pa, hits him dead in his forehead. Moro's entire body crumbles before the might of Goku's fist. And when all the dust picks up, when all else is, is all the majestic and glory and all this wonders and wondrous things that people were just, Planet Earth was just saved. What better than a secure thumbs up from Goku? The Goku says, let me give you the thumbs up. But boom, the earth is saved. But it's not over yet. We got to get some closure. So we will be getting chapter 67 in this, on December 20th. I will try to not read no spoilers on that one. So don't be looking for spoilers on that video. I really, really love the way they did this. They finally freaking executed by, th they finally threw Oob into the mix. That means our next arc can potentially be about Oob, bro. Cause Oob had an abrupt amount of energy. I know Kid Buu was strong, but he sent all that divine energy that way. That's probably why Kid Buu was so hard to kill, bro. But you know, he was so impure and they had to use the power of love and friendship, blah, 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 blah. You know the gist, but now this is Oob that is pure of heart. You feel me? This got this is this got really juicy, but hey, leave me your thoughts, man. How did you feel? How did you feel they took on uh, chapter sixty six? Was it everything that you expected? Were our predictions pretty damn solid? Were your predictions solid? And what do you think was going to happen December twentieth in chapter sixty seven? And as always, if you like what you saw here, please hit the like button, drop a comment, share it with your friends, and I will catch y'all next video. Ooh.